Bueno, vamos a poner el juego desde el principio para que veáis las escenas cinemáticas también, etc. Lo tengo que jugar en 720p para poder hacer esta captura a 1080p. Y en calidad media. Ahora lo veréis en las opciones. El número uno killer es time. It destroys us all. This is what you need to know. Time broke. A growing fracture leading to the end of time. We went after a device that could fix it. Things turned ugly. Paul Stream was there to stop us. He has superpowers. Jack. Him and me both. We failed. Jack. And of course, time travel was involved. Jack. Going too fast for you? Okay. What do you want to cover first? You tell me. Let's start at the beginning. When you first arrived at Riverport University. I came back home to see my best friend, Paul Serene. He wanted to show me what he'd been working on. My brother, Will, was a scientist. He was also involved. Paul said it was world-changing. He was right. Whoa! Come on! Watch where you're going, man! Fuck off! Get out of the road! Riverport University. Here we are. Hey, thanks for the ride. No problem. You'd been away for six years. Paul and I had kept in touch, but, well, not so much. How did it make you feel? I was just happy to see Paul. Bueno, pues ya empezamos a jugar. Estoy jugándolo con el mando de Xbox 360 que tenía de la consola. Y ya veis que los gráficos son acojonantes. Solo hay que ver la cara y modelado de los personajes para para verlo claro. Aquí hay un I guess I should go curioso. find Paul. Good morning. Yeah. Yo sé que está 720p, que con 1080p se ve todavía mejor. Whatever you want. I don't have the time. Ya de repente este tío va a desaparecer, mira. I doubt he's out here. Better head into the campus. Ese seguro que tiene algún poder de, de la empresa monarchesa o lo que sea. Porque ya me diréis, estaba ahí y ya no está por ningún lado. Me va mucho más fluido. <coughs> me va perfecto, se puede decir, a 720p, pero... A 1080p también es bastante jugable para tener una GTX 950, la verdad. Y se notan los detalles en cosas como, por ejemplo, al mirar este mapa, etcétera, que está bastante más claro. Por la resolución, lógicamente. Vamos a hablar con el borrachito este, a ver qué nos cuenta. Rough night, huh? Oh, it's for um, I, it's just whatever's done need matter anymore. I'm, I'm, yeah. Menudo pedo lleva el chaval. Qué 
carteles de salvar a la biblioteca de la universidad. Hay también un cartel con el símbolo de la empresa Monarch. Bicis y más bicis. Bueno, vamos ahora enseguida a buscar al, al prota, al meñique de la serie Juego de Tronos. Lo reconocéis porque es meñique de la serie Juego de Tronos, que está muy bien digitalizado, la verdad que lo han clavado. Y aquí vais a ver... <coughs> Todas las cosas que habéis descubierto en el juego y los vídeos supuestos que aparecen después de cada acto o de cada de cada episodio y supongo que te desvelarán bastante de la historia, lógicamente. Ya los iremos encontrando según avance el juego. Te viene donde donde tienes que hacerlo. Por ejemplo, este que completa el nudo, tal. Son los cuatro personajes principales sobre los que gira la historia. Estos somos nosotros. Esta ni idea. Este es nuestro hermano. Y este es el que nos tenemos que reunir con él ahora en el primer acto, al principio de la universidad. A ver si le encontramos, el Paul Serín. Todos con sus vídeos, donde entenderemos, supongo, bastante mejor la historia cuando los veamos todos. Bueno, pues sigamos con el juego, pues. Unirse a las protestas para que no, no tiren las cosas de la universidad, no se cargue la biblioteca. Z. Paul, Jack, you just got to the campus. Where are you? God, it's good to hear your voice. Uh, when you hit the courtyard, look right. You'll see this fancy modern physics building with the lights on. I'll meet you inside there. I am so looking forward to this, man. You still haven't told me what this is. I know. Why 4 a.m.? Why not wait till morning? Paul had always been a showman. Pues si reunir todas las cuatro de la madrugada es un poco raro. Aquí nos cuenta lo de que se quiere encargar la biblioteca. Ominous. La verdad que sí, es feo de cojones. <risa> en fin, típica universidad americana. Some protest. <laughs> La verdad que a mí me encanta explorar cada rincón de, de estos juegos. Y además encontrarás varias pistas y lo haces, con lo que te recompensa un poco por, por estar viendo todos los sitios posibles todo del escenario, lo cual me gusta bastante. explicando cosas de la historia, etcétera. 
lo cual está bastante bien. Menudo campamento ha levantado aquí los de la protesta. Do you know where the physics building is? You mean the big ass metallic turtle behind me? Hard to miss, man. Thanks. No, I guess sí, it's an army. Babe, can we go home yet? Pedazo de edificio de físicas. Supongo que ahí habrán creado el experimento ese de la ruptura de tiempo. Hey, it's Bobby Radford here on the tail end of the night shift. How you doing, Riverport? Burning the midnight oil? Just waking up? Or are you getting ready for bed? Or maybe you're asleep. I wouldn't blame you. Not a lot going down in downtown tonight. Now, unless you're at the Riverport University campus, where the protest against Monarch Solutions is still going on. Is he Monarch? Come on, Amy, call it a night. There's nobody left to convince. Why not protest, as you If you're with that fraternity, you've done enough damage. We're being shut down. <laughs> hey, I come in peace. I'm just meeting a friend nearby. At 4 a.m.? Yeah, tell me about it. Well, we're spreading awareness about Monarch Solutions, so if you want to know how badly they're giving us the shaft, then you can just ask me. <laughs> All right, what's going on here? Okay. How would you feel if you knew a corporate monopoly was taking a massive dump all over your personal history? Uh, that's quite an opener. Good, because that beautiful library over there is over a hundred years old. It's part of the city's heritage, and Monarch Solutions plans to tear it down tomorrow. Do you want to know why? We've got a chart with all the details. Go ahead, check out the chart. Monarch's tearing down the library to build another research facility. And for what? I bet you're gonna tell me. Hmm, to push their corporate agenda. I mean, look at those numbers. They're slowly taking over the city and everybody's completely blind to it. Uh, it doesn't look good. Hey, I gotta meet my friend, but you keep fighting this, okay? All right, enjoy your booty call. <laughs> Not exactly. Ni eso parece ser la universidad. Destruyendo nuestra historia a costa de nuestro futuro. Muy bien. Plasma tiene aquí pedazo tele. It's not a lake. It's an ocean. He's been gone for five years. Dark matter and dark energy constitute over 95% of our universe. We're just a speck of light floating in an endless ocean of darkness. We 
Jake has a bloody knife in his The light of the flash, he smiles a wicked smile. He lies in the blood of his face, eyes staring. Decían que los vídeos que salieran de las televisiones y demás iban a dar bastantes pistas sobre la historia del juego. Puede ser que esté relacionado. No me extrañaría nada. Paul had always been hungry for success. Driven. He made it onto a lot of those top young professionals lists. And now he was coordinating some huge project at the university. It's a big deal for him. Hey, protest's over. At home. Not why I'm here, Chief. Holster that safety whistle. Prick. Where's your uniform? Excuse me. Come on. I've been in shit enough to smell out security. You sure this is somewhere that you want to be sniffing around? Was that supposed to be a threat? Because that's adorable. Just walk away. Come on, move along. Liam Burke, a monarch security officer. Our first meeting was cordial compared to him introducing a rifle butt to my head later on. Exactly modest, are we, Paul? Luego esto se va metiendo aquí y podrás leerlo seguramente en los documentos. quedan almacenados para poder examinarlos luego con, con tranquilidad. Todos los folletos que hemos ido encontrando, documentos, etcétera. Hey, Hasta el programa de radio. Está muy bien.
Bueno, entremos a ver si encontremos al coleguita. You made a long trip just to see a research project? Well, reading between the lines, Paul was under a lot of pressure. He needed a friend. I wanted to help him any way I could. Son of a bitch. Jack Joyce. In the flesh. The esteemed Mr. Paul Serene. I'm shaking money bags. Shut up and bring it in. Welcome home. Six years. And I was starting to think you'd never come back. Yeah, me too. Come on. This way. We're going upstairs to the project lab. How was the flight? First class. Thank you for that. It's a step up from our van trip to Utah. I missed that van. I'm guessing that Will's not meeting us. He doesn't know we're here. I knew Paul had asked my brother Will to consult on his project. Will was all the family I had, but he was difficult. In here, Jack. Going up. There's more to this than you're letting on. Is it about my brother? Still worry about him, huh? If Will did something wrong, then... Jack, man. Look, I've been tight-lifted about this for a reason. This project we've been working on is going to change the entire world. Uh, why do I smell one of your long-winded presentations on the horizon? I would never. Oh, look. <laughs> a perfectly placed presentation to illustrate the project. Now, who put that there? <laughs> oh, shocking. Okay. Enough joking. The lab's this way, Jack. Come on. Y supongo que el juego pues se basa o gira alrededor todo sobre el experimento que ha encontrado este tío. Come on, Jack. I am about to blow your mind. We'll get to your lab. I want to see your presentation. I know you love this stuff. Come on, man. Dazzle me. Well, if you insist. Progress. Our primary drive is a species. Over time, we have cured life-threatening illnesses explore the world oh good going into marketing spiel mode don't ruin my flow but there Se is one element that denies us true los, los rostros. time itself now I'm not a scientist but here's how it's been explained to me we've known that in theory a rotating black hole creates a deformation in space-time potentially allowing travel through both space and time Years ago, William Joyce, your brother, posited the existence of chronon particles, now known as Meyer-Joyce particles, which fill an all-encompassing field, enabling the constant and steady progression of time. Here at Project Promenade, we have combined both these theories to discover a way to manipulate that field. And the results are staggering. There's more, but that's enough of a primer for now. All right, let's do this. So this is about quantum physics. Paul, you know my brother spent years stuck down that rabbit hole. Is that why you brought Will on as a consultant? When Dr. Kim passed away, your brother was the obvious choice to bring in to replace him. Oh, 
shit. <laughs> you guys must have some budget. <laughs> what is all this? The future, Jack. You are looking at the biggest discovery of our time. It's impressive, but Will's the scientist. What do you need me for? There's a reason we're doing this at 4 a.m., Jack. I need someone I can trust. I need you to help me convince Will. Yeah, I had a hunch. Ya, y te vas a ser el conejillo de India, seguro. When your brother found out the scope of what we were building here, he... <laughs> well, you know Will. Yeah. Hang on, I gotta get something from my desk. Will overreacted, scared off the investors, ranting about miscalculations, dangers, all with no evidence. It works, but they're gonna cut our funding if I don't prove it. You always did drag me to these situations. Me, drag you. One word, Utah. Haha, <laughs> all right, touche. And from what I hear, you've attracted plenty of trouble without me these past few years. Well, apparently it's my forte. <laughs> Jack, you know asking for her help is not easy for me. I am in deep trouble. You see, the tests I have to run here are not, strictly speaking, legal. You're the only one I can trust to help me with this. Whatever Will did, I want to make it right. I love my older brother, but he didn't make it easy. It's already essentially set up. Anyone can do it, but you're the one I want to do this with. Jack, thank you. I knew I could count on you. No, he told us that he y a partir de ahí supongo que adquiriremos los poderes de para del tiempo y demás. I need you to push the lever over there, labeled Cronon conduit. That'll activate the core. I'm going to run diagnostics and make sure it remains stable. Y con esto pues ya habéis echado un vistazo rápido a los primeros minutos del juego, otro día ya igual subo algún vídeo sobre la jugabilidad, peleas, tiros y todo lo que tenga en sí de acción al juego. Espero que os haya gustado y suscribiros a mi canal si es así. Un saludo a todos. Gracias.